Ah, yes, on script timeout. So whenever you are using the reboot prompts, so whenever you are adding a reboot prompt via RMM to an endpoint, if you just add an automated task, and let's see if I have a prompt in here. Here we go. So whenever we add this task, and this is one of the things where you might have to break up your logic and your workloads, but I can have a task that runs, and I can set my maximum permitted execution time. So I can tell it to allow it to run for three hours, five hours, seven hours, however long, that way, if I push the prompt and nobody and no end users are there, the script doesn't hit its timeout limit. So the prompt will stay up, it'll be there, and the end user will see it. There's not a way at the moment, there's not a way to keep the prompt um, in the front focus so you can't keep it in the foreground. If a user put say another window over top of it or anything, it's just gonna stay behind whatever they put the other window on it. But whenever the prompt first appears, it should be uh, it should be on focus, so it should be uh, visible to the end user. And if they say they're not seeing it, chances are it's because they are putting other windows over top of it. But this is the way at the moment the best way to deal with the script timeouts you might be seeing whenever you are running uh these user prompts if you are using these as checks or you have check logic in place for user prompts it might be a better choice to move the prompt logic over to a task and use a check um and have the task leave behind a flag so you can look at it with a check label.